look at how Leanne transformed her bedroom into a Parisian-inspired oasis. Oh, bonjour. I have been wanting to do a makeover of my primary suite for so long because really from when we moved in, it was stuck in the 80s. Dark, heavy walls, popcorn ceilings, pretty nasty Berber carpet. And I really needed to not only give it a lot of functionality, but to give it some real design consideration. I took inspiration from a very happenstance trip that I took with my family to Paris, France, where we happened to stay at the very bougie and beautiful George Sank Hotel. Now, it was by complete accident that we were there, but I took in every single element during our stay, all of which were beautiful and over the top, including their use of florals. And I created this DIY painted mural using a projector. So yes, I did hand paint this, but it was a very easy, easy project to do that has huge impact in the space. Now, the other element that I took great notice of was their use of architectural moldings, and I knew that that was something I could DIY myself. So I added a big framed molding behind the mural, but then repeated that around the entire space with box moldings to really give that clean architectural detail and play off of our new crown molding. Our corners were always dead spaces, so I decided to do a little introduction of built-ins, which I assembled and installed myself. These were just stock cabinetry, and if you notice, I did put on the same wall moldings to kind of make them disappear into the space, and by using touch latches, it meant that I didn't need hardware to give a really clean look. So for storage, this was a big win for me, and adding in a quartz top just gave that luxe feeling and really has become the place where all the pillows get piled when we go to bed at night. We edited the space of a lot of unnecessary pieces, but kept two main ones being the dresser and the armoire. Now with the dresser, I gave it a little bit of a DIY glow up by stripping the entire piece and then restaining it in a much lighter, fresher gray willow stain. Now as for the armoire, this might just be my favorite piece in this space. It was so heavy and really obtuse in the beginning, and I wanted it to feel light and fresh and even make it feel like a bit of a French antique. So I actually painted everything with chalk paint, gave it a little bit of distressing, and then used these really cool paint inlays that give it a toile look and make it look hand-painted, but it's not. Now you know I love a good thrifty find, so when I was on the hunt for a desk that was hotel inspired for the space, I hopped into the secondhand economy and found this beauty for 100 buckaroos. Now it did need a little bit of love, so I added a beautiful high gloss sheen on the bottom in a lacquer, and then a distressed whitewashed finish on the top. I also wanted to add just that final little touch of glamour with a French inspired mirror, and this is a Leanne special that I made myself. It's my first time that I've ever tried plaster molding and I'm pretty pleased with how it turned out. All in all, the room went from really dated and drab to what I think is the most inspiring, beautiful space that will always remind me of my favorite family trip to Paris, France. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> you did such a good job. Leanne Alert Pro, everyone. Joining me now. Okay, you have this vision. You have this vision because you've had such a beautiful time when you went to Paris. Yes. You stayed at the Georges Saint. Saint. So this is a big deal. Just tell us how you scored that hotel room, because there's a story. Oh, it was completely accidental. I was never meant to go on that trip. Okay. It all started with going to a charity fundraiser with my husband, and there was this, a live auction, and we were separated at, at one point during the evening while the live auction was taking place. Okay. And I just, I wasn't paying attention to what was happening on stage, but just caught a glimpse of him out of the corner of my eye, feverishly waving his hand in the air, <laughs> as I heard the price continue to go higher and higher and higher, right. and I couldn't get to him in time by the time that they said going once going twice sold and he's like jumping in jubilee yes. and i said what did you buy <laughs> thinking that it would be something stupid like a ukulele <laughs> and he said i'm taking you to paris and i was like paris oh. ontario <laughs> like, i was so naive i had no idea and he said he was so excited paris france and i said when and he said i don't know and i said where and he said i don't know and i said for how long and he said i have no idea but he just had always wanted to take me and it was coming up to her 10th wedding anniversary Aww. so the trip included a stay at this ultra luxury hotel that again we had to act as if the entire time we were not meant to be there yes. we were not the people that should have been walking around those halls but we absorbed every moment 
the boys, because we took them with us, were like wrapped in the bathrobes in this and gorgeous suite. And you said vision for the bedroom. Yeah. I have to say, from being there, it became more that the motivation was a feeling. I yes. so wanted to recapture the feeling of being in that space mm -hmm. because it really did something to me. I got to say, it like, did. You it had like really... a transformational uh, experience there, and you managed to bring it back home. I, you know what? I feel that I really did it justice for myself and my family. Yeah. My boys come crawl into bed with us, and we watch a movie oh, now. That's and sweet. I actually laid in bed a couple weeks ago, and yeah. I looked around, and I started to cry. Oh, which sounds kind of crazy, but I just felt beautiful. so grateful not only for the space, but for the experience. And now that the space reminds me of the experience of this incredible trip that I had with my family. This is how you bring vacation home, ladies right? and gentlemen. Like this is a beautiful thing, minus and the that's room what service. minus the I'm room just service. Trying to figure out how to Sure.